Hello networkers, we have released a new video training course for deploying a Cisco Firepower or Cisco FTD appliance using the Cisco Firepower Management Center, the Cisco FMC. We will show you how to deploy the Cisco FMC managing Cisco Firepower devices for a number of topics in a common real world network environment and doing all of this step by step. Let me quickly show you some of the things that we will teach you in this course. We will show you how to set up and install the Cisco FMC appliance in a network topology. We will show you the general layout of the main pages of the web user interface. And I will cover some general configuration such as security zones to network objects. From there, we will show you how to set up and add a Cisco Firepower or FTD appliance into the FMC to be centrally managed. From there, we will show you how to configure the interfaces on the firewall to even routing rules, plus setting up dynamic NAT rules or PAT to allow internal hosts behind our firewall to access the internet and public resources. Then we will focus on the heart of any firewall solution. We will configure our access control policy with a number of firewall rules. These rules will work together to filter traffic based on the network, services, web URL, applications to files that our users may access. We will filter based on the network and services of allowed protocols and ports for outbound access and how they are deployed to our managed Cisco Firepower appliance. We will filter traffic to block several inappropriate web URL categories to adding custom URL objects that we can block. Then we will test this out on our user computer to ensure that blocking access to these websites is working. We will filter traffic to block applications that are either inappropriate, not business relevant, or any requirement that you might have. Then we will test this out and confirm that access to those applications like BitTorrent gets blocked by our firewall. We will show you how to set up, use, and test a feature called Security Intelligence, which is my favorite security feature on the appliance. This provides proactive security protection, the first line of defense of blocking networks and URLs with known bad reputation. We will show you how to set up file blocking to malware protection. We can block or monitor certain type of files, which we will show you. We can check if there's any known malware content in the files being uploaded or downloaded, and of course, confirming if file blocking works. And I will cover how to set up SSL decryption and how you can confirm if our firewall appliance is indeed able to decrypt a connection for further inspection. We will cover other topics, such as adding inbound firewall rules along with a NAT port forwarding rule and testing access to that system from the outside accessing a computer using a BNC in the internal network. We will show you how you can set up a site-to-site -site IPsec VPN tunnel on the Cisco FMC to terminate a VPN tunnel between a managed Cisco Firepower device and some other VPN device that is not managed by the FMC and ensuring that the VPN tunnels is working on both ends. We will show you how to monitor connections and traffic being blocked or allowed through the FMC for web filtering, for application control, to file blocking. We will show you how to navigate through the mini dashboard pages and what data you can view about your network and what your users are accessing. And many other topics that you will see for the lessons on the product page. All of which we will teach you step by step in a common network deployment that we use and do for our own customer projects. You can get more details about this training course at roadhub.net.